Good morning, to lads. My name is General Global, and welcome back to Crooked Men. When last time we met the Crooked Men, and now we're going to check up on Sissy. I think I don't know, but anyways, I need to keep quiet because it's like three in the morning. <laughs> well, it's two forty-eight here. So I need to be quiet as my parents are asleep through the wall. Um, where do I check on the fucking sissy? Uh, also, how do I run? I forgot. I forgot how this game controls actually, so sorry. <laughs> uh, but here, no. Here, there, everywhere. What the fuck? What are these? I just moved my mouse. Bar. It's locked. Uh, is there an objective? Save. I don't know why. Let's just save. Uh, uh, what? <laughs> uh, what the hell? <laughs> Scared. What? Was that CC? No, it was a freaking um, three-headed freaking goat. I don't know. Where the fuck are you, CC? 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 You there? <gasps> Sorry, CC. <laughs> what happened? I I went to the window, and the floor. Gave way. Well, what should I do? You should. Sissy, jump over. It's too dangerous over there. Awesome. Ah, N no, I can't. I'm slipping. Oh, wait. <laughs> and I can't possibly jump that far. The gaps. The, a gap this big. Yes. There's no time for pessimism. <laughs> okay, pessimism. I don't know. <laughs> it's going to crumble quick. Hurry, I'll catch you. Yay! Ack! Jesus, bubs. Yeah! <laughs> I, I can't, for the love of me, do girly screams. <laughs> That was too close. Are you okay, Sissy? Are you hurt? No. Sissy? Oh, no, 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 don't cry, please. So scared. I was so scared. No more. Oh, wait. No more. I... I don't like the dark. Why? Why do I? I... You... Uh, what are you doing, girl? Snap, snap, snap yourself out of it. It's okay, sissy. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's okay, sissy. <laughs> I can't. I'm sorry you were so scared. But it's fine now. Don't cry. Ah, that is cute. I am sorry. I was confused and scared. I mean, scared and confused. <laughs> it's alright. I'm glad that you're not hurt. I I don't know. Did you find what you were looking for? No. Not yet. It wasn't in the room with Satan. I wonder where it could be. It must be important if you're looking for it all alone. You can always just give up on it. It's not entirely safe here. I, I can't give up on it. I have to find it. What is it exactly? Sorry to ask, but I've just been wondering. Was it a present or... It was a present from my boyfriend. It was the most important thing to me after my own life. That beautiful piano music in the fucking background. <laughs> ah, I see. 
Sorry if I was rude. I'll keep looking for it too. You were looking for someone, right? I haven't met anyone yet, but can you tell me more about them? Uh, well, I don't know that much either. Just that he's a man around my age. Huh? No, that little about the person you're looking for. He <laughs> he? You're a strange guy, David. Yes, he is. I, I'm not. There is just some things I want to ask. And uh, I don't know how he looks because um, he hasn't sent you a photograph. Strange, but very kind. I would have been hurt badly if you, if you weren't here. I'm really grateful for you, to you for saving me. That is so sweet. <laughs> I should get going. Take care, David. I'll see you. Bye. Have a nice trip to hell. That was a bit scary, wasn't it? I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. Also, what the hell is going on? Excuse me, mom. Can you shut the hell up? Thank you. Oh, God. Sorry. Oops. The, the thing. The mouse is on my screen. And I did not appreciate it. What the fuck? Now what the hell are we doing? <laughs> What in the heavens are we doing? The book. Was that... What the... That sound? Uh, that sound was what? That was somebody banging on the fucking door. Is someone there? Yes, it is the crooked man. That walks a crooked mile. Where do I go? Um, do I have any keys? Like brass key or some other shit? A small key. Except for that one. Because that one is for the surprise. Yeah, that's the library. Jesus freaking Christ. Where does one go in this godforsaken place? Hello, a mounted deer. Poor deer man. The Dr. Jekyll, Jack, you blah blah blah. G, Jack, Kill, and Mr. Hyde. What the hell? How does one pronounce him? Jack, Kill. I don't know. Do I go down here? See if I can find anything useful here. Miscellaneous goods, wooden boxes, tiny box, dim, lamp oil, full of unused equipment, unused chairs, Mr. Chairs, big barrels, stupid barrels. Uh, Barrels. Oh, shiny! Oh, we're finally progressing. There's something here. Bronze key. That is for that one room that was uh, locked. Who is for the bar? Probably. Yes. Yes! After freaking a uh, century and a half. What is this? Let's get drunk. And let's get some uh, apple cider because that's my favorite alcoholic drink. Brandy. It's got a ton of alcohol in it. I might just catch fire if I drink th if I drink this. Eh. Empty beer bottle below that. Empty beer bottles. Empty beer bottles. Empty beer bottles. Empty beer bottles. Empty beer bottles, a glass. Okay, journal. Seems uh, written by a staff member. The last page is rambling and sloppily written. Oh, that's because they're drunk. 
a toast to our owner who left his employees and fled into the night. We'll drink all the beer we've got. Hell is only good thing in here. Being out of the job is no good. Alright, but at least we don't have to see his mug no more. We were so sick that that Eric had always trying to flaunt his intelligence. And selling weird stuff for basement door, having a number lock on the food storage, and his silly crap made the place impossible to run. Plus the passcode was this thing with a book, which he changed every month. What the hell do you do if you forget? Maybe it's good for him, but sure as hell not for us. Ah, oh, whatever. Once we're done with the booze, we're out of here. A toast to our bright futures. The door to the food storage is at far end of the first floor, right? The passcode on food is pretty crazy. Oh, I know. But hey. Maybe there are knives? Alrighty. I'm gonna do the passcode uh, little thingy and I'm going to end this episode here because it's very late and I still need to edit this and um, and and export it and also record EB because that's on my schedule on my schedule uh, the strange case of Dr. And uh, Mr. High. I do not know how to pronounce his name, so. Um, well, his last name. So I'm not going to even try. This strange, this. The blackboard in owner's room said the strange case of Dr. And Mr. Hyde, it be on this shelf, right? Ah, here we go. Oops, sorry. <laughs> what? All I got from that is October 18th, but I don't think that's the case. I don't think that is the case. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> that scared me. Uh, I'm so jumpy. <laughs> Hello, what a lovely picture of your fucking face. And then no way, that monster did it really. <laughs> it's coming this way. Uh, crap, I gotta escape. Uh, aha, if I drop him down here, drop him. For, da for David. Pat. Gasp. What is that monster? So, what I saw earlier. Damn. I can't believe such a thing exists. But there is no way it's coming back now. The room under is locked tight. I should warn Sissy when I see her. I knew it would be dangerous for her. Okay, I think I will leave this episode here. There's no way of me figuring out that fucking passcode. I'm sorry, but yeah, this is this is this game is amazing. It's just filled with jump scares that make that make me just jump because I'm very jumpy and I'm afraid of jump scares, like a little child. But yeah, thank you so very much for watching. Uh, like and favorite, subscribe. And keep on watching Blade 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 Blade